you are not gonna believe the price of this single story home that has three car garage and is on a third acre lot. Now today we're here in Pahrump and we're gonna be touring the Daniel floor plan by Richmond American, so stay tuned. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Now, if you're new to my channel, if this is your very first time tuning in, my name is Dale Abella with EXP Realty. I'm a local realtor here in Las Vegas. Now, what we do on my channel is we go over all the new build communities here in the area. So if this is something you're interested in, if you're looking to move to Las Vegas, or if you like looking at new home build tours, do me a favor, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the notification button. That way you stay up to date with all the newest communities here in Las Vegas. Welcome to Thunder Bluff at Artesia by Richmond American here in Pahrump. Now, just to give you an idea of where Pahrump is located, because I know a lot of you are wondering, we're about 50 miles away, about an hour drive away from Las Vegas, okay? A little bit about Pahrump, smaller town, guys. You're gonna have um, some restaurants. You do have a casino out here. You're still gonna get like your Home Depot, your Walmart. Now this area I'd recommend is for um, somebody that wants to live close to Las Vegas, but you don't mind doing like an hour drive to Las Vegas. It's um, it's gonna be really quiet, really peaceful, but more importantly, it's gonna be a lot more affordable, guys. Pahrump is gonna be one of the most affordable cities here in Las Vegas, okay? So I'll post a link um, that will take you so you could have more information um, regarding Pahrump. In regards to this community, you guys, I will have the floor plans on the screen, okay? So here at Thunder Bluff at Artesia, they have three floor plans they offer. It's the Agate Daniel Delani, all single story, three car garage. They're gonna range from 2,080 square feet all the way up to 2,210 square feet with the base prices ranging from 370,950 all the way up to 405,950. Now, whenever you see the base price, just know that does not include the upgrades and the lot premiums, okay? So you do have to add that. Um, the lot premiums are gonna range about 10,000 to 15,000 here. Now the upgrades are going to be about, I would say roughly about 15 to 20%. It could definitely range just depending on how much you want on there. Now, what they're doing in this community, as far as their homes, uh, most of their homes they're building, they're gonna be spec homes, okay? So spec homes is when the builder picks out all the options, they start building these homes, so that way uh, they're ready a lot sooner. In case a buyer wants to get in the house, well, they have a spec home that'll be ready either next month or within a few months, okay? More builders are heading towards that route. Oh, another thing I wanna mention though too, is you are gonna get, in this community, you are gonna get one third acre lots. Okay, so if you're looking for like space or if you have an RV that you're looking to park, you could definitely do that here at this community. But yeah, other things about the community, you guys, the HOA is only $21 a month. And this community is actually part of a subdivision of Artesia, okay? And uh, altogether, they have about 72 lots here. And now half of, them, half of them have been sold and they have about 35 remaining. And that's all I got for you. Let's get started with this tour. Welcome to the Daniel floor plan. Now this is 2,180 square feet, three to four bedrooms, two bath, three car garage. And the base price as of today is $395,950. Okay, now, um, now if you're building from lot up, you have a choice between three different elevations you could choose from, which I will show you guys on the screen. Also to out the door, if it's $395,950, um, you're looking at closer to the um, high 400s, okay? So around like the 480 to 500,000 after lot premium and upgrades. Now they do have a couple of quick move in as well. So that will be ready in the next few months. And I think those are priced in the high 400s. Let's take a look. Paver driveways included, desert landscaping. Okay, again, these are all um, third acre lots, which is really nice. You know, so if that's important to you, um, look, we have an RV gate row over here. So if you do have an RV, you know, this community is a great option. Very pretty views out here as well. But yeah, let's take a look. 
Now again, with these model houses, there's gonna be a ton, there's gonna be a ton of upgrades here, okay? So if you're looking at spec homes, I would say they're not gonna be as upgraded as the model houses, so I would turn it down a few notches. With these model homes, you know, they're gonna put like all the upgrades in it just so you could really see the full potential of the house. Now, welcome in. As soon as you walk in, you'll notice um, here to the left. So over here to the left, you're gonna have like your laundry room. You'll also have the study room that could be converted into a fourth bedroom. You'll have the two bedrooms over there. And then straight down, you're gonna have like your living room, kitchen, your primary bedroom is gonna be to the right, okay? If you like your bedrooms to be like completely opposite from your primary, um, the guest bedrooms to be opposite from the primary bedroom. I mean, this is a good floor plan. But yeah, let's take a look. So this is gonna be your study room. This is standard, okay? Now, if you want that fourth bedroom, you could definitely do that. I assume when they're specking these homes, they're probably going to do probably some with um, the office and some with the bedroom, okay? Also guys, I know it's kind of hard to see, but we do have 10 foot ceilings here. Now that is an upgrade. If you're building from lot up, I highly recommend it. Having higher ceilings is always a good, um, good investment in my opinion. It just opens everything up. Buyers love that. Okay, so we'll start over here. So you're gonna have your one of your guest bedrooms all the way here in the corner. I would say this is probably 11 by 12 if I had to take a guess. Also too, all the lights, the ceiling fan, those are optional, okay? So in this room, you're gonna have this large window right here, but then you'll also have, you also have your own walk-in closet. Okay. So if I had to guess, I'd say this room is probably an 11 by 12. Okay. So we have this, these cabinets, these are upgraded. Okay. All right. Now, welcome to bedroom two. So right here, this is going to be a full size bed. Okay, so you'll have the window to the front of the house, and then you also have this uh, this window here. It's a beautiful day here in Perum. So this one doesn't have a, a walk-in closet. Okay. Now, as far as the flooring goes, what you're looking at is, uh, this is like 12 by 24 tile. The standard tile is gonna be a 17 by 17 ceramic tile. Okay, so right here, you're gonna have your full bath. So we got, again, everything optional, okay? Undermount sinks, these cabinets, some very nice quartz countertop. And then you ha you'll have your door to get to your uh, your shower tub combo, okay? Now standards, you're gonna have the fiberglass enclosure. Okay. All right, so you'll have this nice wide hallway right here. So immediately right here, you'll have your mud room. Okay, and then right over here, you'll have your, um, okay, this is a pretty large coat closet. Yeah, so you got your coat closet in here. And then I'll take you guys to the primary bedroom. So welcome to the primary bedroom. Plenty of windows right here. Really nice, I love that. 
Okay. Again, look at the backyard. Look at all the space in the backyard. I'll take you guys out there in just a minute. See, look, this is what you could expect when you're in Pahrump, okay? Or Las Vegas, as far as the weather goes. Just nice blue sky, sunny. Okay, plenty of space in this room. Now, this is a king-size bed. Right, just so you have an idea of the space. So you do, you definitely have um, room on the side for side tables. And welcome to the um, primary bath. So here, you'll have the dual sinks. Right? We got the upgraded shower. The walk-in shower. Dang, so look at that shower head right there. It's huge. Okay. And then we have your walk-in closet. Now this, you know, all these, uh, this thing won't be here. Okay guys. So it's, it's going to be just a standard, um, standard closet. I don't actually believe you could upgrade to have a closet like this. I think that's just for show, but I could be wrong. In case you're curious, just, you know, shoot me a text. Give me a call. Cool. So we do have your attic access up there. Okay, so welcome to your main living area. Very spacious, very open. All right. Now we got the optional. Remember in the kitchen, especially in the kitchen model houses, it's gonna be, everything's gonna be optional. If you're curious to know what standard, you would have granite countertop. So the granite countertop would come up to about a four inch backsplash, okay? You'd have maple cabinets, so it'd be kind of like the wood looking cabinets that would be 36 inch, because these are 42 inch, okay? And then a refrigerator, washer and dryer are not included. Um, we do have this optional, like, what is this? A, uh... okay, so this is the oven microwave right here. So that is optional. Nice large pantry. Right here. I know to some buyers, well, having a large pantry is an absolute must. I also think it looks good. Like when you have quartz and the quartz, you have that quartz backsplash that comes all the way um, to the cabinets. I think that looks really nice but that is a little bit on the pricier side. So we have the profile, the built-in electric cooktop. Now this is Pahrump. You're gonna have all electric, no gas, okay? So, and that's, that's just Pahrump, guys, so expect that. So beautiful stainless steel sink. All right, let's check out outside. Now guys, if you are interested in a new build community such as this, or if you're curious, or if you have any questions with Prompt, or if you just plan on, you know, you wanna visit, you wanna visit the new build community, give me a call, shoot me a text, give me a call. Um, you know, I'd be glad to go with you on your very first visit. Something that you don't wanna do guys is, you don't wanna go into the new build community your very first time by yourself because the builder agents have a, fiduciary relationship with the builders that means they look after the builder's best interest but as realtors we look after your best interest so you know that's why we try our hardest to negotiate for you to make sure you get all the max builder incentives to walk you through the process i definitely would be honored to uh, work with you but if you're working with a realtor as well that's fine too at least you know let your realtor come with you on your very first visit because otherwise if you register if you go to new build 
and they get your name and your email address, they won't let you have representation down the road. And you definitely want representation because, um, you know, the builders actually pay the realtor fee. So it's a no brainer, it's no cost to you. But yeah, check out this beautiful backyard. See, that's the thing, you can't get one of these like, if you're looking for a large lot, um, I mean, Pahrump, like Pahrump is like a good option for a large lot because this in Vegas, again, if you were to buy this same house and I don't even know um, where you could get this type of lot, a third acre, but if you were to buy this in Las Vegas, this would be like, you're looking at like 800 to like a million. When out here in Pahrump, let's see here again, Daniel base price is 395, 950. They got some quick move-ins here for 480, okay? So a $500,000 price difference. But yes, I know it is It is prompt too. Some, I know a lot of you want to stay in Las Vegas, which makes sense, right? Location, location. But yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I showed you the home. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Again, if you uh, have any questions regarding this community, um, give me a call, shoot me a text. I'd love to come with you in your very first visit. Other than that, I'll catch you guys on uh, next video.